Hey guys, it's Lily. So, I hope this is recording. I think it is. But uh, I'm going to do a Lush haul. I went to Lush a couple times since the last haul that I showed you guys. And I'm in love. Oh, by the way, Happy New Year. Sorry about my last video. That was This is my first video of 2012. So I'm kind of, kind of excited. Um, and yeah, let's get started. I was going to do a updated foundation routine and an updated skincare routine because... My skin has been really, really bipolar this year and this pro this last year, 2011. Um, I've been breaking out and I'm getting acne scars and yada, yada, yada. But my new skin regimen is so much better for me now. Um, my acne scars are going away and um, my face is less oily. Um, it's still oily, like really oily, but it's not as much as it used to be. Um, so yeah, let's get started. So the last time that I made a video with my Lush haul, you guys seen um, the cupcake face mask and um, what else did you guys see? Is that it? Oh, and the tablets and I think that that's about it, right? Well, let me show you the first thing that I've got. It This is the, um, the coal soap face. Um, it smells like coal, and when you when you rub it, what you do is you just lather it on your face. Um, it's just like soap. You rinse it, and then uh, you lather it up on your face, and then you go in and work it in. And it's probably like the best soap I've ever used. I love it. It's really good for my face, and um, that's one thing that I got. And I've been using that for four weeks now, and it's still going strong. And um, so here are some of the soaps that I've got. Um, I'm already using Angel's Delight Soap. Um, only have this much left. And it's a really, really sweet soap. I like it a lot. And then another thing that I got was Honey, I Wash the Kids. I heard this was a really popular soap. Um, and it says an original Lush Classic with Soothing Sweet Honey. So um, I got these two. And then I went back and got some more yesterday, I think. I got um, a Ring of Roses Gentle Rose Body Cleanser. And then I got um, another Angel's Delight Soap. And this thing is huge, like so. I got both of these. Um, so I'm excited to try those out. They're both really like sweet and floral, a touch of floral. Um, Another thing that I got is the lip scrub. I'm, I really, really like it. It's really, really good. Um, I like just eating it. <laughs> um, but no, um, my lips are really, really dry. Like no matter what I do, they just, they just end up drying like crazy. And the only thing that works for me is I use this, and then if I, if it doesn't come off, like if I don't, I don't get everything. I use a toothbrush and I use I like gently scrub my my lips and then after that I put Carmex no I put Vaseline on when I'm this is this is what I use when I'm before I go to bed um, so that my lips are exfoliated and you know it I when you exfoliate your lips get bigger but I mean I have no ready to press but it's just I don't like having Vaseline. I mean, I use, I don't like, I love having Vaseline on my lips because it's just one of my go-to favorites. Um, if you guys know my skin regimen and my lips regimen and all that, my face regimen and stuff, you guys know that Vaseline is like my holy grail. I love that stuff. But this stuff, I, all you do is just uh, put a little bit on your lips and scrub and then you can lick it off. How awesome is that? Uh, I remember, Mich I was looking through and Michelle Fan actually has a lip scrub herself that has Vaseline, honey, and sugar. But this tastes exactly like bubblegum. It's so yummy. Um, another thing that I got, again, I got some more um, green tea tabs. I got five. I thought I ran out, but I actually have two more at home from my last haul. But um, I have five in there. And a really, really fun fact. Um, when you guys put this in the water, um, don't use that much water. Uh, have a bowl like this big like this big, and then fill up the water like to here, and then put the tab in, and then save the water. The water actually works as a toner for 10 days. 
So yeah, I don't know if you guys knew that, but um, one of the sales rep had told me that last time and I was like, what, are you kidding me? I bought this thing for $10, $20 and I could have used my own toner because I like the tablets better because it's, it's a multi-purpose use since I'm, you know, uh, opening up my pores and then I'm also um, using it to cleanse and um, just, you know, and then another thing is the toner itself with the tab and the tabs are $3.95 and I don't know, I was just like, oh my god, seriously, but anyways, um, so next, I got the Tea Tree t Water Popular. It's a popular toner, and it has reviving grapefruit, ju juni juniper berry, and tea tree toner for faces in need of clarity. Effective but gentle on oily, spotty, and normal skin. Use on cotton wool to remove excess cleanser and to refresh the skin. So this works as a toner and a fix plus. So I absolutely love this product. Um, I still use my Clinique um, toner, and I also still use my... Um, my, what is it? Oh, my Fix Plus, but I like using this at night um, after I cleanse my face, so I should do a skin routine, huh? Um, another thing that I got is the Cosmetic Warrior. Uh, I just got done with my cupcake one a couple weeks ago, and yesterday when I went to go get um, some more Lush products, I actually wanted, I had my eyes on the Love Lettuce, because it's also for oily skin, but uh, they ran out. So I decided to get the Cosmetic Warrior because it, um, they were saying how it, it disappears, it makes the, your acne scar, like, lighten up where, so that it doesn't, isn't that noticeable anymore. And the smell of this is atrocious. It's, ooh. I had this on yesterday, I, like when I first day I got it, no Tuesday, and like I literally was about to hurl, like I, I could not stand the smell, like ugh, it's got awful, but I um, only used it once so I don't know how good this, this stuff is, um, but yeah, there's garlic in it, garlic, green grapes, honey, eggs, corn starch, corn, 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 corn starch. God, I cannot speak. And tea tree oil. Oh, God, it's, it smells god awful. You go to your nearest Lush hall or hall Lush store and smell this product. You guys would throw up. And I have to put this on my face. But supposedly this is good stuff, so I'm using it. Hope to gosh that this works for me. And if it doesn't, then screw you, whoever told I'm just kidding. But hopefully. Um, another, last but not least, um, another thing that I got since my, I'm done with my cold face and, you know, I'm almost done with that, I had to get another, um, facial cleanser just cause I'm in love with Lush and I was already there. So why not just go for it, right? So I got the herbalism. I was going to get the, um, dark angels. Is it dark angels? The one with the, like the black, that's dark angels, right? Um, I was going to get that, but I was like, you know what, with the hair, you got the cold face and that was dark and gloomy, might as well try something, um, for problem skin too, um, and this is for, it's just, it says facial cleanser for oily and problem skin, so I got this, and, um, I used this in the shower yesterday, and this smells like nasty poop, I'm just kidding, um, can you say I smell it, <laughs> just kidding, um, ugh, the smell, it's unbearable, like, some of the smells, for Lush is just kind of overwhelming, but it's really good for, like, everything that I've tried is really, really good, um, and I've been trying so hard to find out what's going on with my face and why is my face so sensitive sensitive now, like, even more sensitive than before, and I don't know, but, um, Lush is doing really, like, all Lush cosmetics that I've been using for oily and problem skin has been working for me really, really well, so I'm enjoying the products, but with herbalism. All you do um, is basically grab a little bit and then uh, make it into a paste in your hand. Like add a little bit of water, make it into a paste, and then just put it on. And that's what I've been using. Um, my whole skin regimen is totally different now because um, I've been trying different things and I'm just so impatient to see results to the fact that like I don't like stick to something, but this I'm actually sticking with. Like I really, really do enjoy these products um and yeah so i think that's it if you guys have any recommendations from lush 
um, that I should try out for oily problem skin, please tell me. And what I hate the most that I don't, I, my shower and my, like my shower, I don't have a bath. It, I don't have a bathtub. I just have a standing shower. Like I've, you guys seen my bathroom before. So this is the only thing I have. So I can't try their bath bombs. I'm so, so, so upset. I mean, I could go upstairs and um, use like, like the family bathroom, but no, thank you. I'd rather stick to my own private four walls. Wait, one, two, three. Yeah, four walls. Well, there's, yeah, there's four walls. Let's go. Well, actually, no, because that counts as three. Right. Okay, anyways, let's not get architecture or whatever. Anyways, um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please look out for a skincare routine next. Um, and also an updated skin like foundation routine. I've been doing a different routine also. Um, I don't know if you guys can tell, but I dyed my hair for the first time in four years, and I don't. I love it. I really do. I don't know if you guys can tell. Um, let's do an outfit of the day too. Um, I'm just gonna start up. Okay, I'm wearing a H and M sweater that I got in Cincinnati. I'm also wearing brown leggings. Um, I don't want to move the camera, but I'm wearing a blue, long blue uh, button-up with a brown belt, and yeah. But yeah, uh, I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, please subscribe, rate, comment, all that good stuff. Um, follow me on Twitter, that's where you guys, as I repeat at all my videos, follow me on Twitter, that's where you guys find um, the most, the most about myself and my personal life and, well not my personal life, but like what I do on a regular basis. Um, a lot of my subscribers had tried to add me on Facebook and Facebook is a whole different story. I might even delete my Facebook here soon actually, uh, but Twitter is where I connect with my subscribers and my friends. So find me on there um, and also for all you iPhone, you, iPhone? iPhone users, um, download Instagram. It's a great, great app. I love that app. It's an awesome, awesome um, app where you take pictures and you show everybody like what you're doing or what you're eating or what's, what are you intrigued with and all that. So yeah, so that's about it. Take care, y'all. Bye.